The sport of kiteboarding has developed many disciplines, from racing, freestyle and surfing. The most original aspect has always been just boosting big air. This is still one of the most exciting disciplines. Today we're going to take you to Maui for the Nash Black Box Kite High Jumping Competition. The question is, who's going to catch the biggest air? In windsurfing, we used to jump pretty high, and now in kiting, it's, it's just a whole new realm. You're like twice as high as I would be jumping windsurfing, and I come down way softer. And that was the rush for me when I first started kiting was I just wanted to get really high off the water, and it's a big rush. If you compare high jumping today to like five or six years ago, it's a huge difference because today a kite is extremely great, it's very safe, and they're way more user friendly. And a lot of people like to push themselves and see how high they can go. So average riders jump between the 25 to more advanced riders, maybe a 40 foot, and then some people pushing the 60 and close to 70 feet. For kiting, high jumping, like first thing you need is a lot of speed and a lot of power in your kite. And what you want to do is head in one direction and send your kite back the other direction as you're hitting a piece of chopper wave. And some of the jumps are up to 73 feet plus for some guys and the distance is super far. 